Let's now go to Way 31's Nicole Zedek. Nicole, you're in our Way 31 storm tracker this afternoon. And unfortunately, you didn't get very far before these roads deteriorated and they deteriorated quickly. Yes, Marie, I am still on Montesano right now, and I actually got in the Way 31 Storm Tracker powered by Lynn Lane Chevrolet at 310 this afternoon, so nearly an hour ago. And so far, we've only been able to travel about 1.5 miles down the mountain. Take a look at the road conditions right now. I'm going to flip the camera ahead. You can see just this massive backup. You're taking a look right now at the very end of Montesano and Governor's Drive heading towards Hampton Cove. You can see a lot of cars backing up, not only on their way here towards Montesano, but also heading towards Hampton Cove. We hear there's another wreck over there. That's actually where we were heading to when we got in the storm tracker nearly an hour ago, but we have not been able to make it down the mountain. Mountain. Now, currently, people are definitely taking precautions. They're going barely five miles per hour as they were going going down the road. I'm actually going to flip our camera behind me so you can see the backup of cars coming down the mountain as well. You can see the snow flurry still coming down, really sticking to the tree branches and sticking to the roads, making for some very, very slick, slick and icy conditions. Now, as we come around here, you can see this massive pileup, people even getting out of their cars walking because they've also been in their car for nearly an hour now. The conditions, if you do have to get on the road, be prepared for major backups, extremely icy, snowy roads, and really take your time. You can see, actually, we also saw a fire truck on our way off the road into a ditch here on Montesano. We were passing it right after it happened. You could see Huntsville police was just coming to the area to try and help the situation there, but that just shows how icy these conditions are. The fact that a massive fire truck could go off the road. So that is also causing some backups up here. As far as the conditions, take your time, ice on the roads if you can, and really be, bring your patience as well because there are some major backups. We'll be live in the Way 31 Storm Tracker Bauer by Lynn Layton Chevrolet again at 430, bringing you all of the latest conditions on the severe weather for now. Nicole Zedek reporting live in Huntsville. All right. Thank you so much, Nicole. Stay safe out there. Incredible video. And of course, we will check in with her throughout the throughout the evening. And again, if you do not have to be out there on the roads, please stay home or stay wherever you are until DOT crews can treat the roads and get them back open.